Good evening. Welcome to dot programming dot blogspot dot com. Uh, today I will show you a list and the combo box in Java Swing. So create a new project that name is list combo is the name of the project. So is the last one the list combo. Add a new JFrame uh, form uh, similarly um, with the previous tutorial. So class name is list combo box example and the package name selected list combo yeah that's the design surface of the swing window now add a controls that like this list and combo box in java list first of all add a list control add a list control by using the modal property you can change the items of the list that is default item item 1 and item 2 by using the modal property you can change the items okay so add uh, items like apple orange grapes mango pea sectors so these are the fruit list items and you can change the list modal editors class okay that's fine now save this I click on a file and then file yeah these are the names apple orange crabs mango and pea you can uh, by using control key you can select multiple items uh, in the list okay so we have a list selection value changed event I mean to say when we select any item in the list then we can show we can show that item in your console window as well as your uh, on your label control so system dot out dot print ln I want to show that item on console window so only uh, I want to show a simple message like event changed okay first of all check it run file yeah select the apple yeah but uh, when we select two item when we select one item then display two uh, two times message on console window so if you want to remove this then add if iterations print two items at a time when we select that so remove this if you want to uh, print only one item at a time if the name of the list box is list uh, by using the event handler evt argument sorry get value is adjusting is a method through which we can select only one item at a time and print also one item at a time dot get value is adjusting okay that's fine now save this and run it yeah when we select that item yeah only single item at a time presented okay that's fine <coughs> now uh, I want to display a selected item on a label control so simple add a label control on your on your design window okay
now come to the design window add a label control change variable name that is list label lst list label the design for events list selection value changed event and comment or remove this line and set that value on label list label dot set text and the text is get selected index and get selected value of the list box so they list the name of the variable by using change variable change the name fruit list okay so save and come to the code part move here fruit list dot get selected value by using the get selected value we can get the uh, item which is selected okay select apple but when we uh, select two item at a time only one item uh, will display on label control okay so if you want to display multiple item on a label control so remove this method that get selected value I want to use get selected value list here get selected a value list values list sorry get selected values list here dot to string that's fine now run this run it yeah at it uh, array will display on a label control grabs mango p yeah that's fine okay now come to the combo box part <coughs> combo box uh, in a combo box we can select only one item at a time but add multiple items so here we have a three combo box with item one item one and item one you can change by using model property you can change that items first of all change the variable name that is month combo day combo and year combo much better model property change the items of the combo box 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 sorry 10 11 12 yeah e, these represent days month model property okay that's the month and year Two thousand one, two thousand two, two thousand 
2003 okay that's fine when we select any um, day month and year uh, from the drop down or you can say combo box then what happened action performed method when we click uh, or you can say select item from the combo box then will display string s1 intellisense will not display uh, when we creating a variable uh, in this this dot j combo box okay change the name of the variable that is here combo this dot here combo dot okay get selected item dot to string capital system dot out dot print helen s1 dot oops s1 okay run file yeah 2002 will display 2003 thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial Please keep watching.